if I can be part of what helps you, but you do the major work or you make the final thing, you're gonna own it more. So what I would do with people is I'd say, simple, here's your problem. I want you to write down what the problem is and describe it in two sentences max. This is your memo. Two sentences, crystal clear that anybody will understand it. If, if, I have, if you have to write more than two sentences, you have to tell them a paragraph, the question doesn't work. It has to be a maximum of two sentences, ideally one, so crystal clear, anybody can understand it. That's number one. So you write that down. You write down, define the problem with precision. Describe the problem or the request. And sometimes it's not a problem, sometimes it's a request. Can we turn the air conditioning up? Can we turn it down? Can we have lunch at whatever time? Can we do this? Can we do that? Whatever the request may be. So they write it down. Then the second thing I have them do is describe three solutions to their request or problems. Three, and I use keywords, three cost-effective, intelligent, viable solutions. Might be viable, time viable, resource viable, whatever the case may be, viability. So what are three intelligent, practical, viable solutions that we could, you believe we can implement, that you believe we can implement to solve this or to meet this need? By the way, why do I come up with, have them come up with three? Someone tell me why. One choice is no choice. Two choices is a dilemma. Until you have three choices, you're not at choice. That's my rule in life. You may not like all the choices. Whenever you think you have one choice, one choice is no choice. If you got two, you're in a dilemma. There's always at least three choices. Plus, I'm making that person become a problem solver. If I solve the problem, they'll just have a new problem for me to solve. But if I can teach them to be a problem solver, the game changes. How many follow? Now, sometimes this is less efficient, but with a mass audience, it was very efficient. And then they turn that in, and then I then have a choice. I can now respond back by saying, circle, I accept your request, or I think solve the problem, we'll do it with your number one. Or I could modify it, I'm willing to do that, but I think we need to do this and this is the way to do it. Or I could reject it and tell them why. And then we'd have this communication. It was very efficient. This is very different than, you know, tell me what you think we should do in a suggestion box. So now, tell us your question and then tell us at least three answers.